Alright, welcome guys and gals. Um, spoke briefly in a, in a previous video about this game. Um, and I was just reading through the Steam reviews and I saw a couple comparisons to Cult of the Lamb. I thought that was hilarious because that was the only other channel that's active on my my uh, my uh, YouTube channel and uh, only other series that's active. I don't know if I said that correctly, but um, you know, if, I think it'd be a nice chill game to kind of relax to. We might turn the music down even more here, but I I've kind of tuned the volume settings to a point where I feel like they're acceptable, and and I'd love to get rolling here. I. I'm very excited to play this game. I've, I've watched like, you know, maybe 30, 45 minutes of, of gameplay and I already knew it was for me. Uh, and if nothing else, I think my wife will enjoy watching this one. But let us load into a game here. Uh, I've not played it at all, so we will see. I don't know how much narration I'm gonna be doing. I probably should do some. I won't skip the cutscenes too for immersion, but I'll, I'll try to tone it down. That's all it would take for me to somebody just, just tell me that there's sushi. I'm on the way. What a cute intro. Cheho Wong. Um, I don't know how I feel about credits on the intro scene. I mean, I. Skip them, do I not skip them? Uh, Young Ho Kim? Is that the same one that's the, the kicker for uh, the Atlanta Falcons? Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Pressing the escape button. Oh, that's really bright too. Oh, man, it's so bright. Jeez. Oh. oh, Dave, you got here quickly. This guy's name is Cobra. Jeez. I was told to hurry here. I was on vacation, you know. So where's the sushi at? Don't rush yourself. Have a look around. Look at this giant blue hole. I've never seen anything like this. It does look beautiful. It's not just the size. Every time you enter the giant blue hole, the terrain and ecology changes. Which means this could be an incredible business opportunity. What kind of business? Well, we can discuss that later. I heard you took a break from diving. How about warming up? I'll guide you from here. Go ahead and go on in. Uh, a sushi bar by the blue hole. Send me. That's beautiful pixel art, though. Nice form. Left shift, you can move quickly. Okay. Good. Looks like your skills are intact. Your moves are as nimble as a freshwater snail. Hmm. <laughs> Let's now practice using the weapon you'll need in contingencies the dive knife. Try using the survival knife on small fish. You can use the left arrow key. Hoya! 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 Oh. 
I haven't used one in a long time. Do you aim first and then, uh, um... Looks like you need some practice. Let's use the harpoon to catch three fish. Aim, fire. Squid. Oh. Seagold. Ooh, a dory. Tang. We should get back on track in no time. Alright, come back up to the boat. Doesn't give me a choice. But I don't mind coming back up, Cobra. Okay, now that you got the hang of it, let's get down to business. Dave, you love sushi, right? For sure. That soft fish meat with oily rice. Oh man, that's just the best. Oh, well, listen up. I have a friend who's a sushi chef who left the business for a while. He has a bit of a sharp tongue and a slight temper, but he has one skill that I can guarantee is unmatched in the world. It's right here that I started a restaurant with my friend that sells one-of-a-kind sushi. The sushi sold here is made from fish, fresh fish caught in the blue hole where fish from all over the world can be found. Don't you think people will just go nuts for it? Awesome venture as well. I mean, I love... Yeah, it doesn't sound too bad, right? Sure. You have to pay though for sushi. No way! I can't wait to check out sushi. Chat with the restaurant. Um. It's very clean animations for a pixel art game. Although they did have a huge dev team, it looked like. We all ready to open? Happy life is one that ends with whatever tasting the beauty mother nature can offer. My calling is to bring the taste of mother nature to every- This is where that cat's meow. Oh man, this is not cool. good night diving that's like a difference between night and day diving seems Mancho is really passionate about his work let's get to talk about sushi boy huh the incident oh no all right this is where i'm just getting really excited about this game just watch people dive around it's so it's a very beautiful and you just man i telling you i just i'm a slut for fishing and for harpoon fishing i i might just be something something new um let's go a little bit deeper down do i do it well didn't mean to do that but uh, what are those what are those? Pyramid butterfly fish. Um, clownfish. Yep. Don't know what my max depth is, but. Kahime. Boink. Looks like we are doing some damage. Don't know if I should just continue trying to. Ah! 
don't know what kind of damage I should be expecting. Okay, let's just let's just not. Let's just not. Picked up with these gloves. So sorry. So sorry. Um. Keep going down. Ooh. Don't mind if I do. A shock bang stick. A stick type weapon that resists powerful electric discharge. Just pick that up. Eh. Come on, I watch you. There we go. Oh, oh man. It's a masher. It might be loud. I hope that's not too loud. Need some. Ooh, what is. What are we looking at here? Uh, do I need to, like. Nope. Nope. Alright, alright. I get it. Um, let's just capture a few more of these guys. Uh, five of seven. Six of seven. Oof. Let's try one of these big boys. Okay, and we're out. So that's seven. We're not gonna not gonna try anything special here. Second to call the escape card. The escape card. I mean, it fit the it fit the the theme, you know. Imagine just like hopping on the back of a giant fish and swimming to the surface. A giant cod. That loads of money in no time. So this is where you get like kind of the overcooked uh, thing going. Time number one. Time depth obtained seven. Okay. I need to like. Okay, no, I'm just cooking greens. Wrap up your day. So we want to get back to the sushi restaurant. By the way, you'll only be able to dive once in the morning, once in the afternoon. Um, get the ingredients ready for. So you can dive twice per day. Good, good intel. Used to enhance the taste of sushi. Pay attention to how many ingredients are left. Uh, ingredients. Here you can check your fish crops, sauces, and all the other materials you have. Um. Dishes. 14, 13, 10. Uh, sure. My food on the menu can be sold to replace items on the menu or refill the ingredients. Okay. Enhance the flavor of the dishes to try it out when you have enough ingredients. Like eight of those, it's probably a good like five of these guys. And I guess we just add all that we can. Okay. Sometimes customers order drinks, press S. Whew. 
<laughs> so he preps the fish and we just take it out. Oh man, I'm channeling my inner bear right now. I need hands. You can dash when... Wait. Okay. <laughs> it's like that I pressed the wrong button. Might be the best one I've ever seen. Uh, it's going to the far end down there. Run, run, Dave. Hands. Uh, we got a. So that's a gray boy. It's coming to this guy. Hands uh, to server number eight. Table number six actually uh, has a pork allergy. out of debt already. Close for the day. Boncho Sushi closed. Made like 89 bucks or something. 76 bucks. Artisan's Flame. Okay. But it's kind of like uh, kind of like that Moonlighter game. I remember you like you go and you loot objects and you sell them in like your family store afterwards. Um we're finally done for the day. My back and legs hurt. You were a bit clumsy, but not bad for a first day. Hee <laughs> hee. Eat, pray, love. It's just like my mom's kitchen. Oh. Slap on the. Oh, oh no, never mind. Is he gonna swim to the surface? Wow, they really. He's really dead. He dead. Uh, Tin 2. Ellie. Hey there. This city biology at the Holy Old Graduate School. I've come out to investigate after Fort's Monopoly today. Ecology. Give me some agar and a red starfish. Isn't agar the stuff they use in, like, uh, labs to, you know, like, grow bacteria on? I think that's Agar. Here's your phone. Various types of content. Yeah, yeah. You probably want me to look at it. No, we don't need to call in. 
it's right next to us. Uh, agar, two red starfish. Let's let's go on a dive. We got we got about ten more minutes left in this video. I think we can knock out one dive. I love the the fish facts too. I feel like uh, I think there was like a Twitter account that was like uh, like something facts. Hey, let me pick it up. Is Kahime just uh, edible marine brown algae species with a round pillar like stem? I was, I was expecting seaweed. Maybe it, maybe that's like the that's a different name for it. I can't pick up can't pick up urchins yet. Ooh, we got a predatory fish over here, perhaps. Well, uh, we're just gonna leave them alone for now. Don't you don't you try to run away now? Gotcha. A Titan triggerfish. Sounds pretty nice. Uh, ooh, it's one of those big big honkers. Oxygen. Any oxygen down here? Because I need some. I also need some fish. Let's grab a few dories. <sighs> Try to get over here. Perhaps there's. Uh, Stuff on the ground we could um no. No. Okay. We'll just use our escape pod then. Oof, it's actually quite close. Well, I mean I guess hopefully we can get another dive in later in the the, the day then. <laughs> Because we didn't really get too many fish, that is. A gun. Oh my. This is the, uh, like the 30 minutes of video that I've seen. Stella <laughs> just ended. Okay. So I discovered a fascinating giant blue on the train. Yeah. You piqued my interest. To prove myself to you. One rope and one scrap iron. Is it bad if I just just dive back down there? We're in the afternoon, so oval shaped, relatively long and thin body, spines instead of scales. It's worth finding. Cloacal. Not the cloaca. Alright, we need to get more fish. 
happens to be a uh, cryo. I see that over there. We're gonna check that out first and foremost. Oh, is it a shrimpy? Uh, not a shrimpy that I can use. So an O2 tank is useful. Let's kill some more dories. I want one of these boys. I'll take a dory though. fish this go around. Looks like there's an escape pod right there. We'll try not to use that immediately. Uh, we'll fight this guy. Just keep on just smacking him. If we could throw this oxygen tank and just like jaws him, you know. You didn't even hire money. We would carry any more. Um, yeah, I think I'm good. It's a lot of fish. Call it there and try to get some upgrades, perhaps. Oh man, this is such a chill game, though. You know. my number. <laughs> oh, thanks for the olive oil and soy sauce. Uh, cool. Cool. Yeah, we need to do our overcooked for the evening. No, tomorrow's Wing Wednesday, but I uh, found a restaurant around here that does half price sushi, which their rolls are huge, so I'm a big fan. Um, I need to set the menu first. Get 10 of these guys. Can we enhance it? There it does like a lot more happiness, I guess. Oh. it again um. oh there's only okay it consumes like three of them what is that does it cost something to enhance or just the fish itself, I guess. Uh, we'll keep enhancing. And then last one we'll just throw on what's our most expensive fish here? This guy. Sure. Um, are we not gonna repair things? Just gonna open. 
What is this menu thing over here? This is just really fun. I'm not gonna lie. I, uh, the, uh, the kitchen part of it, it's like pretty simplistic so far. I, I mean, the setting the menu is kind of cool and you can enhance the roles and whatnot, but I mean, it's, it's really satisfying though, like getting everything right. game like osu i don't know if you guys ever played that game before but where you use like your mouse to go along with beats of music oh hello there mr dr bacon <laughs> mr dr bacon the sea people why are the sea people japanese Oh, sea cows, and sea dolphins, and sea fish. My assistant closely analyzed an artifact found nearby and found that it was from no known civilization. Um, this do you have with me? Well, you seem like just cryptocurrency investments didn't pan out. You won't be around for a good while. That's why I'd like you to help me. 70 meters or so below the surface. Please go take a look. Smooth your point. Alright, I'll help. I'll upgrade the diving suit you're working for free. Wow. The eye diver app. Oh man, I gotta take a step back from my screen. This is, this is a very bright game. It wants you to enhance various diving equipment, upgrade equipment. Why don't you make a sushi bar? He's oh, telling me to unlock my phone. He's about to scam me. But they hit me with that Nigerian prince, Shulala. Okay. Oh. Use eye diver to enhance your equipment. You can enhance your suits as well as your cargo box. Oh, yeah. Don't forget that anything can happen in deep waters. So I'll be in touch. Well, I mean, I'm. Not... I'll end it there. Chapter one complete. You know, there's no greater stopping point than the end of the chapter. So we are gonna save. We're gonna write that save file. Maybe. 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 Sure. Manual save. Um. Uh. Okay. Well, thanks for watching, guys. I mean, that was that was really fun. I'm actually really excited to play more of this. Um, I got a couple games on the dock now that I actually really want to play a bit more of. Um. Still been playing a lot of Battle Bit, just kind of in my free time. It's not a game that I found too easy to commentate, so it's not a priority really, but 
you know, I, I've thought about making some shorts for it because I do I do tend to not be terrible at it occasionally. Um, and then Coals of the Lamb is going to continue. Um, my most recent batch of episodes are not my best work just because I was kind of kind of sautéed whenever I was recording them, but kind of flambéed, you know what I mean? But uh, it's flambasted. Uh, shellacked, I don't know. Um, but I mean, there's still there's still content. Um, I, don't, I might think about like recording over them because I feel like there's just too many long stretches of silence. Um, but uh, thanks for watching, guys. Like, subscribe. Um, I'll see you in the next one.